boys, nice and high. Tip off goes to Houston. And the starting lineup for the Pelicans. Evans and Gordon are the guard set. Pondexter and Davis fill up the forward slots. And it's Ashik in at the five. Evans kicks to Davis. Can't hit from in close. If they could end every possession with that shot, they'd be happy. Nine times out of ten, that's an easy layup for them. Well, for James Harden, with his incredible regular season last year, Clark, you knew he was in for a great postseason as well. And it was a bit of a roller coaster for him in the playoff run. I mean, he could vanish one game, but then explode for 40 in the next. Here's Evans. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. Pelicans on D. And Lawson, here we go. Ariza has the open look. Evans with the rebound. And with Harden in the playoffs, it was an all-or-nothing situation at times. He definitely stole some games for Houston in their run to the conference finals. But, man, did he have a rough one when they were eliminated by the Warriors. He can be a weapon if he gets going early from long range. There's a screen by Moda Yunus. Harden outside. Tried to come right back with the three of his own, but it's no good. And you know, that tough game for Harden in the conference finals, a dozen turnovers for him, set an NBA record for most turnovers in a playoff game. Not how he wanted to go out, but he showed he can carry a team for stretches during the playoffs. For Houston, they've gone just one of four to get this game started. And there's a reason that's good on the assist by Harden. Excellent work there in transition. Yeah, I think it's always better to go early in transition, to attack when it's there, because oftentimes you can beat the defense down the floor. Now here's Evans. He has five. To the left wing. Here's Pondexter. Nice shot from the wing. Lawson with it. To the inside. Here's Howard. Lays it up and despite of the excellent defense at that. Howard's got his second basket of the game. The Pelicans have gone three of five shooting the ball so far. Screen by Ashik. Gordon outside. And another three for New Orleans. A lot of space right there to get that shot off. Not a very good job of the defender getting over the top of that screen in that particular play. And for the Pelicans last year, they were at their best when they had great ball movement. Very tough to guard their team when the offense was so active. Took him no time at all on that one. Davis has got his first points of the night. They've wasted no time settling into their offense. Yeah, they're lasered in. I mean, really making the most of their possession. Defensively, that possession better not start a trend because they just handed him two points. Here's Evans following the basket by Monte Yunus. He hits Harden with the drive. Howard kicks to Lawson. Ashik comes up with the rebound. Yeah, and listen, sometimes even the best of us are going to miss the easiest of opportunities. Davis, and the shot is good, dropping in off the front of the rim. Davis has got his second bucket of the night. I tell you what, guys, it's going to be a tough day on this defense if he's got the A game rolling tonight. Stolen by Evans. Here's Hashik. The basket good off the assist from Evans. It seems that every pass they make is leading to a score here. I mean, that's just exquisite ball movement. And that's because the ball is looking for the best shot, and it's really paid off for them during the run. Now, here is Harden. He's had some playing time, but no scoring yet from him. Man, I love to see James Harden go to work and shoot that ball. New Orleans leading by six. In the corner, it's Gordon. Evans against Lawson. Gordon for three. Can't get it to go. And the Rockets take it the other way. Here's Harden on the win. And Davis sends it back. A minute 20 left here in the first quarter. Pondexter, no good. You look at what Anthony Davis has accomplished so far in his career, the historic comparisons. 
I mean, they're, they're mind-boggling. For a kid 23, Greg, the historic comparisons are very favorable for him. Uh, I mean, he's been compared to a, a young KG and, and Duncan quite often. But in this first few seasons, his numbers look the most similar to Hakeem the Dream. And that's about as good a, a company as you can get. You know, and the funny thing about Davis having similar numbers to Hakeem, he came very close last season to putting up a quadruple double. Hakeem was one of only four people to ever accomplish that. A platoon swap here for New Orleans. 56 seconds left to play in the first. Jones. Oh, that's blocked. That was a good rebound right there, but they haven't been very strong on the glass so far. Clark, a little disparity there in the rebound numbers, but some of that comes down to how the ball bounces. Let's see if it evens out. Vito Davis might get a quadruple double at, at some point. Last season, he had 30 points, 10 rebounds, and five blocks on four different occasions. The rest of the NBA had a combined zero in that category. There's 31 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. Holiday against Harden. And that one's good. Four second basket of four, shooting 50%. He presents a defender with a serious challenge, always. Screen by Jones. Here's Beverly. And no good trying to get that one. The scoring fast and furious as we end the first quarter. Pelicans lead by six. And we'll be back.